Um, this is a quick video about Schaefer the mouse. Um, this is how the little carrier is set up for him. This, um, these two things are uh, spool knit items that I think are great for mice. Um, this one is just a little strand and that kind of imitates other mice so um, it wouldn't feel alone. And this one I put into a circle and that's a little nest for him. Now this actually is about two inches across, an inch and three quarters this way, um, and it fits right on him. I'm going to take this out. This is, as he gets older, he's going to want a jar with cotton and shavings in it. There he is. That's how little he is. I think this is the fourth day, so he's still alive. Um, now, last night, that's how he was sleeping. Um, was in this little ring and that again imitates other mice around him um, and it's actually good that he's trying to get out of there um, but when he this morning what I did was I removed the ring and I put it over here because when you're rehabbing a mouse you want it to have to get up and search for food so I took his comfort zone away this morning and then left him like that for a little while. Um, now, I had been concerned, um, and obviously a lot of you are going to hate mice anyway, but um, I had been concerned because he had had droppings um, the first day and a half, and then there weren't any, so I was afraid I wasn't getting enough food into him. But this morning we have droppings, so it's working. And like I said, he is still alive. His eyes are not open yet. Um, he tends to fall asleep when eating. He's really a, a baby. I mean, a baby baby. And um, I was feeding him pureed carrots. I've ordered uh, from the supermarket baby food, more carrots and bananas uh, to give him some fruit. But what I just did was uh, cook some rice, and I have pureed the rice. And um, that's a grain. It'll be bland for him. And the carrots um, seem to be a little bit thick. So the rice has come out a little bit better, and we're going to be doing that today. But if you have to rehab a mouse, um, rehab is the main word. You want to try to imitate the conditions it would have normally, not only with fake mice around it, but that it has to get up and look for food and water. Because if you ever release it, that's what it's going to need to do. That's their whole function once they're an adult, is they look for food and water. So, um, just a little video on, on Schaefer.